in a nutshell the mistake we've been making in recent past is we don't discuss this we wait the child goes into high school nowadays at the end of primary school already a lot of the children are very very aware very aware of the opposite sex in fact the relationships begin sometimes as you know earlier and earlier in the life of the children they are exposed nowadays to so much of the opposite sex from a very early age sometimes in a way that we would feel they still needed a little bit more time before they were exposed to this unfortunately the world is progressing you find adverts sometimes of a mere drink or a piece of clothing whereby they show a woman may allah protect all of us almost naked and this woman is supposed to be for example displayed in the presence of our children that wasn't the case a long time back and when i say a long time back i'm only talking of about 15 to 20 years ago it's becoming worse as time passes and if we don't take this into consideration by a young age already 10 11 12 12 people want to experiment they want to try they want to see they want to have their girlfriends and boyfriends from a very early age and not just that they fancy someone but they take the relationship to another level that would be unacceptable according to our values according to our morals according to the ethics of Islam and of our African tradition and culture may Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala grant us protection so we need to address the matter like i said from a very early age start talking about it befriend your children and remember you are never ever going to force your child to marry whom you wish because it's not you getting married i want to repeat that again because many of our fathers seated here today may be guilty many of our mothers may be guilty you want to choose your the spouse of your child hang on dad you chose your own spouse you had to sleep with her whom i'm going to sleep with i shall choose you can guide me yes you can guide me yes i expect your guidance and i want it but you cannot impose your choice on me please it is not permissible actually according to the majority of the scholars it's not allowed it's not you cannot force whom you want on a child who does not want that particular person it is the responsibility of both the father and the mother to ensure that you have communicated with your child as the child grew up or grows up now the question might arise at what age should i speak to my child well i would like to think at the age of 10 and 11 and 12 especially nowadays there is no fixed age you need to have such a relationship with your child that you can speak about in a joking way inshallah you'll be getting married one day you know i have a son he's not here with us right now so i can say this inshallah it's something good 10 years old 11 years old and i always tell him inshallah you'll be getting married soon and he says no not at all no way you see so it's the opening of a discussion and then as they grow a little bit older you start saying you need to look for someone or you need to be able to have someone who can be the best mother to your children you need to be able to have someone who would be the best father to your children and you need to know don't be impressed solely by looks or by something materialistic that people flash from now from time to time you find people flash things sometimes yes it's dazzling it might attract you sometimes the person who may have a lot in terms of materialistic wealth may be a very good person so that person is chosen not based on their wealth but based on their goodness and what could also be possible is those who may have a lot might not be good in some cases sometimes you have a person who does not have much in terms of materialistic living but they may be so arrogant or very bad in terms of culture or in terms of character that subhanallah you may want to stay away from them so there is no rule to say the rich are bad and the poor are good because you find some who are poor who may not for example make the mark may allah subhanahu wa ta'ala make us from those who understand